Yeah, you know, uh, coming off the off day and, and having gotten swept on in L.A., it was nice to come out and get a win. You know, Garcia's start, we were looking forward to seeing uh, how he would respond. Um, I think overall it was good. You know, he had a couple times where, um, you know, had a little bit of command trouble where they, they worked some walks and were able to put together a couple runs after uh, – the ball by guy got by Castro and they and they got the double in the corner. But I, you know, for to go to go that deep in the game for us in his first start, um, get his first win as an American leaguer. I know he's beat some American League teams, but um, yeah, it's, it's just a good way to start the series after after the what happened against the Dodgers. What impressed you the most about how he was able to maintain that composure when he was tested, especially with those leadoff hits and things like that? You know, I think he trusted his fastball a lot tonight. Um, you know, he tried to use it to get ahead. I don't. I think almost every hitter he faced throughout the evening was a first pitch fastball. And, uh, you know, he mixed in enough sliders. He tried to save that pitch maybe till two strike counts, and the changeup was good too. But, um, you know, even though you're a veteran and you've, you know, pitched for a couple teams, when, when you transition somewhere under the circumstances, it's going to add a little bit of, uh, you know, it's just a different feel, I'm sure, for him. So to get that one out of the way and put a win on the board, that was big for us. And you had a nice night offensively from the last three guys in the lineup. All of them had a couple hits. Yeah, uh, the bottom did a nice job. Uh, you know, Granite had had a couple good at-bats, and Adrianza had a couple hits, including one on the hit-and-run where he dumped one out there into left field. And Castro, he's had, you know, he's had a pretty good road trip, had some big hits down in L.A. and, and followed up tonight with a couple doubles, too. Garcia was able to get a couple double plays when he really needed it. Was it, was able, it seemed like he was able to get the ball down what he absolutely had to. Well, I, I think that, um, you know, to make pitches uh, in big situations, uh, it was the second bases loaded, nobody out. And he got the strikeout, and then we got the ground ball the second. Uh, you know, there that was huge for us to turn that. Miggy started a nice double play there later on in the game. So, you know, I think those guys that can, you know, slow the game down, even with when, when there's traffic out there and they make pitches and they find a way to minimize the damage. How comforting is it for you as a manager knowing when he goes out there, he's going to most likely, good or bad, get you deep in the game? Well, it's it's been his, his track record. Um, you know, I, I looked at, you know, his past several starts, you know, the, the amount of innings he's pitched. It's, it's generally, you know, he's going to get you that six innings more times than not. Um, and he does it fairly economically, so it gives him a chance to stick around later into the ball game. You know, he kept telling me um, after the fifth, after the sixth, he was good, he was good, um, and, he, and he made it stand up. I took him out there after the single there only because pitch count was getting up there, and at that stage of the game, we only needed seven outs to go.